Transformers one week and just a couple weeks later or a week later. Yeah, that's almost just a little over a week later for Cobra Kai season three. So got some good Netflix stuff coming up at the end of the month. Shut up. You don't think Ryan is famous? Cousin Ryan. You gotta... Hey, what's up, YouTube friends and family? It's Cousin Ryan, and I've got another trailer reaction for you tonight. This time it's the Netflix series Transformers War for Cybertron Earthrise. I believe this is the final trailer as this is coming out. 30th of this month. Um, no secret, I'm a huge Transformer fan. Generation 1 was my childhood, so let's go Generation 1 all the way. Through nostalgia goggles, it's completely superior to everything else. Um, yeah, call me a G-Winer, that's fine. Now, I've already obviously watched uh, the first part of this trilogy, Transformers War for Cybertron Siege, which I liked. I liked. It was good. It was solid. I expected more edginess from a Netflix like original series. I thought it would be geared more towards adults and it wasn't bad. It wasn't bad. I enjoyed it. It was great. I just expected a little more edginess, I think. A little darker even. Um, so I'm hoping maybe it takes a turn in that direction uh, in Earthrise. And let's see, what else did I have? Well, the criticism, I didn't... I get we can't have all the characters sound just like they did in Generation 1. And it wasn't the actual voices that bugged me about the voice acting. There was just something very monotone or something about all the, the voices. I mean, there was some, there was emotion in it. I don't know. There was just something off. Uh, and I don't know if that'll get corrected here or not. I kind of doubt it, but let's see what this looks like anyway. All right, here we go. Here we go. Anybody home? Do you know who I am? Oh, yeah, the Quintessons. I know what you are. That is enough. Bring me the ugly one. Oh, Which one's on. the ugly one? We'll check that. The future is unwritten. Focus your mind. Take us to the Allspark. I need to break it to the Decepticons, but they've already won the war. Not yet they haven't. There's still some spark left in my circuits. I'm so glad someone on our team can fly! You'll never escape this dead place. You must stay on the path. For a much darker future awaits. I will guide you to your rightful destiny. You will kill Optimus Prime. And take the Matrix for yourself. Well, there was an old Quintesson ship there from the 86 movie. I don't trust you. Oh, Good. is that? Never trust yeah. anyone. Unicron, nice. I think I'm more excited for this one. Yeah, December 30th. That's just a few weeks away, right before Cobra Kai Season 3. Um, but, yeah, I like the look of this. I'm interested to see how they handle the Galvatron-Megatron dynamic. You know, in the Generation 1 cartoon, Megatron became Galvatron. And I'm not as familiar with the Marvel comic from the 80s, but I believe... In certain continuities and now I'm, I'm, I'm getting them a little confused but it might have been the Simon Furman stuff from the UK Galvatron was actually a separate Decepticon leader from the future I don't know some of you guys could probably correct me on that but I'm wondering if they kind of pulled from the comic book the original comic book continuity to make a Galvatron a separate or is this you know Megatron of the future coming back to talk to Megatron of the past you know Megatron of the future being Galvatron. Anyway, I, I like the look of this. Um, I think it looks pretty cool. I'm excited for it. Um, it looks like it's pulled a lot of mythos from some of the original Transformer 
stories and yeah just just a few weeks away just a few weeks away and cobra kai season three i can't wait transformers one week and just a couple weeks later or a week later yeah that's almost just a little over a week later for cobra kai season three so got some good netflix stuff coming up at the end of the month all right thank you guys for hanging out with me and checking out this transformers trailer i'm excited it's got my seal of approval it's got me ready to watch it the night it comes out and until next time be excellent to each other you know, sir, it's cousin Ryan and the Hollywood bully bar. You know, sir, he's bigger than any superstar. All of us pity is some, some real to a bar. Some of them sweeter than any chocolate bar. Boom! Hey.